You can't always tell who someone is on the inside when you meet them. The identity they present is a charade with layers of deception. The more you probe, the more you learn that they're cut off from their true selves. Others, on the other hand, we admire for their sincerity and integrity, and we respect them because they're authentic, honest individuals. So how can we live like that? How can we live our life to the fullest? If you're eager to explore how to be your authentic self, we're with you with the ways and the phenomenal advantages you may get when you embrace authenticity. Number one, perform a personal inventory. When do you feel most yourself? When you're not wearing a mask or compromising your essential principles, asking yourself some direct questions might help you figure out who you are. It will be simpler to make decisions that are in keeping with your authentic self if you have a clear understanding of your beliefs. Which people, activities, or circumstances make you feel most alive? Is there anybody or anything in your life that makes you sad, furious, or toxic? Then take it to the next level. What's truly going on in circumstances that feel terrible to you? Make a list. Who are you with? What feelings arise? How much did these events cost you emotionally and physically? You may be able to tell what needs to be changed just from this practice. Prioritize the people and activities that make you happy and meaningful. If you really want to live a more authentic life, you may have to leave such poisonous relationships and settings. Number two, pay attention. Authenticity requires the ability to pay attention to oneself, regardless of what's going on around you. You're not conscious of your own state of being if you're always preoccupied with your internal chatter or responding to external stimuli. Focus inward when you're worried about how you look, whether you'll get along with others, or what you should do next. Consider pausing to breathe and checking in with yourself throughout the day. This will help you develop mindfulness and recognize when you're acting inauthentically. With heightened understanding, you will be able to express yourself more thoroughly and take acts that are more in harmony with your true nature. Number three, be true to yourself. Your thinking must be in sync with your inner self in order to be honest. People frequently ignore their inner voice. You must first be aware of your inner self, trust your authentic voice, and then have the guts to articulate it freely in order to be your own person. If you disagree with someone's concept or conduct, or if you disagree with a choice or conclusion, you must express yourself. Living and expressing your truth will allow you to say no to things you don't want to with the same ease with which you say yes to those you like. Number four, take simple steps to become more authentic. Authenticity may be a challenging idea to grasp, but when you think about it, it all boils down to your daily behaviors. Because it's the insignificant things you say, the decisions you make, and the actions you take that sum up to who you are. Daily Routines If other people's values take up most of your time, you'll naturally feel like you're not living your truth. Take some time to determine your priorities for the day. Job chores, exercise, and adequate sleep. Make time every day to make a little progress towards your own goals. This might be as easy as spending a few minutes investigating a job shift, or engaging in a fun art or activity. Make a commitment to those minor things. It'll amaze you how easy it is to notice how minor adjustments build up. Number five, get some perspective by taking a step back. It makes sense to use all of your mental resources to discover a solution when you're stuck. However, such a technique may occasionally lead to a loop of overthinking. Take a moment to think about it. You might lose track of who you are once you're hyper-focused on an issue. Sometimes, taking a step back and detaching oneself from a situation is necessary to view a more comprehensive picture. Take a day or a week off and do something enjoyable. Taking a pause allows you to listen to your heart and gut instincts, and organically, solutions will come to you. So will you be happier if you live your authentic life? According to a 2008 research published in the Journal of Counseling Psychology, people who are more honest feel happier and have a better self-esteem. In a 1997 study published in the Journal of Personality and Social Psychology, researchers observed that showing up truthfully in a capacity as a friend, coworker, or student leads to increased pleasure and reduced stress levels. According to a study published in the Journal of Counseling Psychology in 2006, honesty improves romantic relationship happiness. You dwell in the flow when you figure out how to be your true self. 
You're naturally gifted with creativity and abundance. Self-confidence comes from consistently living according to your underlying principles. You believe in yourself and realize that you can achieve your objectives despite hurdles. When you strive to be authentic, you'll be able to form genuine bonds. Because you express yourself genuinely, you attract like-minded individuals who believe in you for who you truly are. Strike a balance between staying faithful to yourself and acting in a way that's respectful of the social circumstances. Remember, the world needs you to become who you are at your heart, the person who dances behind closed doors. Learning to be authentic takes guts. You set yourself free and begin to develop a life that provides you joy and significance when you do so. You won't get there right away, but you can get there.